Welcome into the two minute drill, Olivia Landis. And today I'm joined by defensive lineman Quinnen Williams. Quinnen, nice to have you on. Thank you so much for joining me today. Uh, nice to be on. Quinnen, a lot of your coaches and even some of your teammates talked about how you came into camp in some very good shape. Now we saw some videos of you in the off season pushing SUVs. What were some yeah. of the challenges of getting in shape during this pandemic? Man, I faced a lot of challenges, man. I had uh, went out and found a new trainer, Don Somerville from Different Breed Sports Academy, and he put me through a ringer, man. I came in, I told him I want to be in the best shape I ever been. I want my body fat to be better than I was in Alabama and different things like that, man. And he looked at me and said, it's going to be hard, but if you want it, you got to push it. I'm not going to make you do anything, man. And I hit it head forward then, man. So I came into camp, man, feeling great, looking great, and just running, man. Like, I'm way better than coming in last year to this year, and I, I just feel it this year. Why was it so important for you to come into year two in some of the best shape of your life? Just because I know that was a huge aspect on last year, man. Like, just coming in with an ankle injury because um, probably nutrition, probably uh, endurance, different things like that. My uh, all season was just built upon being in the best shape of my life, being in phenomenal shape. Nutrition-wise, I want to knock down so much body fat and just be explosive, man. Just work on different things like getting stronger, getting faster, just just to help my game in general so I can be the player that I supposed to be and the player that the Jets want me to be. You mentioned getting stronger and getting faster. Have you been able to see some of those results on the field? I definitely have, man, definitely. Just explosive off the ball, making explosive moves, explosive power moves. I feel more stronger um, in the run game, more stout in the run game, different things like that. That makes my, makes my uh, confidence go through the roof because all the hard work, I can see it, I can feel it. I just, I can feel it being shown and being put into work. And I just think to myself like, I, I had to work harder now because I can feel it. I see it. So, Quinnen, one of your teammates recently, Henry Anderson, praised your work ethic and talked about how he sees so much potential in you as a player in your second season. What else do you think you need to work on now that you've already gotten into really good shape? I need to work on a lot of stuff, man. All those guys in the D-line room, man, that hold me accountable and push me every day, man. Um, like, during the, during the quarantine, we talk to each other how we work, and I send them videos of me boxing and doing different extreme training and stuff like that. And they send me videos of them trying to outdo me. With the things I got to work on, I feel like I still got to work on a lot of stuff, man. Just getting back into it from being, not hitting each other, not being in pads, not putting my hands on a, a human being that's moving. Of course, I got to get back into it, but I feel like I'm at a great start right now. I feel like the defensive line is a great start right now because everybody in the defensive line room work their butts off. Now in year two, how important are techniques? Uh, it's very important. Um, just because my year one, I know I was kind of sloppy in my technique on the different things that uh, I was coming in. Still had rookie jerseys and things like that. And the just different small stuff like hand placement, foot stepping and things like that. I know I was supposed to be right in line alignment and stuff like that, just being nervous and things like that. I feel like this year, man, is a whole different ball game, man. Like I said, it's early in training camp and it's early in the season and stuff like that. But a lot of guys, man, in the deepest line room, hitting it off the gate, like steps being right, everything being right, focus on the technique, focus on everything. Because if you're in shape, you ain't got to focus on getting in shape. Well, perhaps one of the most important parts before I let you go, your braces are off. Do you feel yeah. like a new man? How does it feel? <laughs> it feels good, man. It feels great just to have my braces off and things like that. But feel good to floss and things like that. So. <laughs> well, you have a great yeah. smile, so congratulations. <laughs>